nibbling on my hands. Not afraid of my hands at all. Look, there goes Jaws. Hi, babies. You guys get all the food off my hands. <laughs> if you look back at the videos before, they wouldn't go near my hand, but now they're just swarming around it. They, they just love it. Thank you, subscribers. We have, I think I have 55. Well, that's good. Just they're just coming, y'all. And like and subscribe the videos that you want to see more of and that way i know what you know i can do more of if you just like them all that's fine i'll just keep doing them because i'm going to keep doing the ones that i like to do but if you see something that you really like then uh comment and like them and i'll do more of them good news brochures coming up today um How do Bible principles? It's about Bible principles. So, uh, oh, there he goes. Did you see him go through the loop? There you go. Of course, it's Steve. <laughs> Steve is just a little sweetie. Come on through again. I just really like seeing him do things because, you know, it just shows you that he's the the one that pretty much responds to the things that I want them to do. Um, you know. You can you guys like my hand, huh? It's not gonna hurt you. I get a little bit more food on there, then I'm gonna go ahead and feed them. They're helping. So that way they don't you know. Goldfish are always hungry. And of course, in the future I've gotta give them a bigger place. I wanted to put them in like a, a pond type thing. Later, there he goes. He went through it again. 
I don't know if I got that part or not. Because um, they get pretty big, you know, pretty humongous, like at least 12 inches. So you can't keep them in here very long. These are babies right now. So there goes coral. There goes jaws. They both went through. There, guys. So, you know, we'll put them in something bigger. Eventually, I would love to get like a human-sized tank. I might even look up how to make them, guys. You know how I am. Crafty. Make my own style. Get the right proper things to put them together. Because I know they have that glue and certain type of glue and certain things you have to do in order to make them. But, you know, it's not beyond me to try and do it. And I'm pretty sure I might even end up doing that. Who knows? I see what's all involved in it. All I gotta do is look up my, the fellow YouTube YouTubers, and somebody has put one on there. I'm pretty sure. I think I did see something where they made their own. They showed you how to make it. There goes uh, jaws went through once. I don't know how this is gonna show because I can see a shadow in the back. I want to get them out of there, but sorry about the. Uh, way it's recording but I don't have a re anybody to record for me for today but um, they're looping through you guys want a little more or a lot more <laughs> yes that I just love watching them it feels really cool the way they even nibble and how friendly they are it's just beautiful how they trust you like that you know but you can put your hand in there and they you know deliberately come up to you compared to how when I first got them they were not as ready to come up because they were like nervous you know I think it's good right here they were nervous to come in uh, near my hand Because they have a fear of man. Every living creature, animal or fish, they um, they have a natural fear of man. That's what that was put in there for the creator, from the creator because of mankind. You know they will tend to hurt creatures. Some do. <coughs> they have to be ready to protect themselves. But once once they trust you, they get to know. Look, look at Steve. I am shocked. <coughs> Don't show that type of aggression just because my fingers here. Look, now he's trying to be <laughs> trying to go after Coral. Now Coral's going after Steve. Guys, there's plenty for everybody. Plenty of fingers. There's one, two, three, four, five, four fingers and a thumb. I'm going to call them five fingers. How about that? My own thing. Unless Adam named everything. I think he did. Look at him. There's just what. There's more than one finger to go around. Don't fight over them. Coral. Steve and Coral. You two. Shameful. Put a little bit more in there. I'm just having fun doing this. But then I'm going to dump their food in there. So they can just go for it. I just love for them to come around and see what I got, what surprises I've got for them. And they're fighting with each other. That's cute. That just like, you know, I had some birds that would fight for competition. Competition. And I was like, no. You have to train them in a good way that you know you don't need to do that this one is a male I believe that gold one we call him Steve Harvey and the other one's a girl and the reason I say that because they say the males are thinner and the females are more rounded just like in humans and um, Jaws is you're thinking was a girl but he seems to be coming out to be a boy 
for some reason. You know, the shape. Okay, guys, hold on. I'm going to get some more. And um, yes, I give them the flakes. I give them vegetables. You can give them fruit. And some people are like, don't give them those flakes. They're not good for you, them. But I've always raised my own flakes. And they're just fine. Not just flakes. You can give them shrimp. You can give them... There goes Steve. He went through the loop. You can give them different things. It doesn't have to be um, just um, flakes either. It can be... Um, vegetables, which they like vegetables. And this summer I'm going to give them some fruit and I'll let you guys see me feed them the fruit. I think I'll start out with, well I'm going to check and see what's the best. I don't just give it to them, you know, because I like it myself or anything. I go by what other um, people that have the actual same pet and go by that. So, you know, that way they've had good experience with it. And um, just look at them, guys. They're just enjoying my hand and going through the loop that I put in here. Just a little toy for them. I don't leave it in there. Well, they probably would love it with that string, but I think they'd probably tangle themselves. It's just a temporary toy. I've got to do something else. I'm just kind of like playing around with ideas. And see, there he goes. There he goes. <laughs> he likes it. So just play around with the ideas and um, whatever they seem to like more, I'm going to permanent. What do you call it? Permatize them. That's my own word. So that way they can have it in there for good. No. And I haven't taken out their, they have other things down here that they hide or whatever and I haven't taken them out yet to like scrub them because I want to make sure they get good bacteria in there and their own little things established in there for their, you know, tank and then I'll start taking one out at a time, scrub it. Another one, I'm not going to take them all out and scrub them all. I don't do that. But I don't know if you guys have seen it, but they have this cool, come on, 12 minutes already. These hoses, which I'm going to get one day, it's, they're colorful. The, the uh, breathing, you know, for their, for their air bubbles. They, I saw red and green, I believe, or something like that. They're really cool. Only like $4 and something. 4 to $6, I think, at Petco. So check them out, and then if you see something cheaper that's online, they'll pr price match it. There goes Coral, she went through. They'll price match it for you, some things. They can only do so many things, that's what I was told. To price match. But I went in there to get the um, stress coat, and I saw it for four sixty three, I believe, at Petco. And I went in the store and I'm like, oh, I don't see your uh, stress coat. And they had it like around the aisle. And so once I went around there, I found it, right? He found it for me. I was like, oh, there it is. But then when I get in there, it was like $7 and something, um, 6 something with the tax. I mean, without the tax or whatever. $7 without, you know, they gave a little discount or whatever. But I was like, um, I don't see the one that's $4 and something. And he's like... Well, we'll check and see if it's online, that price, and we can price match it. Some things we do, some things we don't. And then he said, oh, I can go ahead and give it to you for four twenty three. And I was like, yes, that's what I wanted. That's what brought me in here, this price. So, you know, always ask if you see something, a different price when you look it up. So that way you can get that deal. And sometimes they have in-store coupons. Sometimes they have online coupons apps or so forth just keep checking for every deal you can get because you could probably get things almost free sometimes they both went through I hope I'm getting all this on video but I'm letting this video continue it's a long video today because I'm just having so much fun with them but anyways um, look for the good news uh, 
video I'm gonna put one out today because it's Saturday and um, it's gonna be really interesting really interesting and you benefit from it that's why I put them on there because um, I benefit from them so why not share and it's also a uh, command that we share with others good things so we want to do that because we're fellow humans and we supposed to love each other and care how others fare in life so anyways I gotta end this because already 15 minutes I, I don't know who's gonna watch this whole thing but except me maybe <laughs> oh there he goes again I got him on the last minute so anyways comment on what you like so that I can add more of those videos for you and thank you again subscribers um, We'll make you proud, make you some good entertainment, something good to watch on a boring day, on a lunch break, on a housework break, just for entertainment itself. See you, see you later for good news. <laughs>